Yo, <laughs> bloody actor here, guys, and welcome back to yet another episode of uh, Kenyan Gaming Setups. Yeah, I'm not a tech reviewer, so remember keep your negative comments away from the comment section because I'm here to showcase what you guys are rocking. Do I seem happy? Yes, I'm happy. It's in the fucking morning. These are my hours and uh, blee, blah, 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 talking too much stuff. But uh, yeah, if you want me to visit you, if you want me to check your setup out, be sure to hit me up on the Discord, on the fucking comment section, on Instagram, pretty much where you can find me. Everywhere you can find me, I'm going to respond to you. And uh, yeah, so today I'm going to be checking my boy's setup out. Uh, he's called Mr. Romano. I think the first time I heard of him was on the screams, probably. That was the first time I saw your name. I was like, <laughs> Roman San 254. But that's his user type everywhere i believe that's what he said earlier because this is like the fucking 10th take but uh yeah uh let's go check his setup out so yeah guys uh come check his setup out um uh, again, this is another setup where it's a mix of uh, work and uh, gaming space. So, um, as you can see, pretty, pretty clean. Very clean. I like the setup. There's a lot of natural light um, in the scene. Overall, pretty, pretty clean. Another clean one. Again, I'm jealous of these um, um, setups that people have uh, because, you know, mine looks like shit. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, man, uh, let's go to what this guy is uh, rocking on the um, case here. For the case, he's rocking the Fantex uh, P360A. I think it's similar to Higgs, only that this one has a front grill. I think uh, the cameraman can come on the front there and see. There's a front grill showing the lovely RGB fans spinning in there. So, um, yeah, man. I like it. I like it. Um, has tempered glass. I'm sure you've seen the reflections as we were walking in here. So pretty cool. And on the inside there, he has a, for the CPU, he has a Ryzen 5 2600, which is a six core, um, 16 thread, uh, not 16 thread, sorry, 12 thread processor, which is uh, cooled by a deep cool Gamax, um, G Gamma Max. I don't know if it's Gamma Max or Gamax 400, 400S, pretty beefy cooler. Um, for the RAM there, he's choosing to go with the, uh, with the Force Vulcan Z DDR4 that 200 megahertz uh, RAM, which is 16 GB, which is uh, eight gigs each. And uh, for the GPU, he has an RX 570, eight gigabytes. Pretty, pretty nice. And uh, for the memory, he has a, for the SSD, he has an, uh, a crucial 500 GB NVMe SSD, which is also paired up with a Western Digital 500 gigs hard drive. All of this is mounted on a Motormax B540 motherboard from um, MSI. It's another Motormax. Uh, I think Higgs also had the same motherboard. And powering the whole setup is a Power Master. Not a power master, sorry, but a cooler master 550 gold standard uh, power supply. Pretty good specs there for the uh, for the CPU for the case there. Pretty nice. I'm sure you guys are enjoying what you're seeing. And uh, yeah, let's go to the display there, which is um, an AOC 24 uh, inch 144 hertz monitor. Pretty nice, pretty vivid. As you can see, it has pretty vivid colors, um, which is mounted on its own original mount. Uh, for the keyboard there, he's rocking the Logitech K845 mechanical keyboard. Pretty nice to type on. Um, has that signature uh, mechanical um, sound, uh, the mechanical clicking sound. So pretty, pretty nice. For the mouse there, he's choosing to go with a Razer Viper Mini, which is wired. Um, pretty good mouse as well. I've seen this one being sold on, uh, uh, I think, Andy Shuffles. Andy Shuffles, yeah. Yeah, Andy Shuffles. Told you guys is going to be featured here. Pretty good, uh, pretty good guy. And for the overall mouse mat here, um, it's a pretty, pretty good one. I like this is the coolest mouse mat I've ever seen by the for like, like, like uh, mouse mat people are rocking. This is like a pretty big one. This is a very, very big one. This is uh, it's how many? Look at the size here. It's one point. Uh, it's one meter, five meters. I think it's one meter. Is this horizontal or I think this? Wait, this is horizontal is sideways. Or one meter and a half. Okay. But yeah, pretty sick mouse mat. You told me it's custom. Wait, where, where, where did you buy this one, Kwanzaa? The mouse mat. 
Andy, Andy was on selling this. Oh my god, what this guy, hey, Andy. And uh, for the sound, he's choosing to use uh, earphones. Uh, I'm just glad to see I'm not alone using earphones because my headphones are really sharp. <laughs> but uh, let me pull them in. But these are the KZZX um, Pro earphones. Uh, pretty cool ones. I like the way they're shaped, they seem to be comfortable around the ears. And for his internet, uh, his, uh, I think I did not, I've not been mentioning the internet uh, people are using, but for the internet, he's choosing to use uh, the JTL 30 Mbps package. Overall, um, the estimation or the price estimation that has been written here is 150,000 Kenya shillings, which is on the mid-tier side of, um, um, like, it's not extremely high end, it's not extremely low end, so it's apokatikati. So what do you use this uh, setup for? Uh, it's mainly my workstation but uh, i just made it so that i could pair my gaming into it all in one go okay. basically it's not any heavy duty gaming it's just basic stuff like apex once in a while uh, a few car games like uh bmng which i'm still yet to download are uh, you planning to get that uh, whatever racing wheel well I, I built a rig i just don't have a wheel currently to use on it oh. all right actually all right. it was mostly inspired by uh, nyangao from um, racing it's, 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 i know watches these videos eh? yeah, you, you're inspiring guys out here <laughs> uh, he's a cool guy as well but uh, yeah nakana kusasa we are but uh, we'll eventually get to him but uh, yeah did you assemble everything like individually or did you buy it as a pre-built unit no most of the work was done by andy Obviously, I was standing over him while he was doing it because I was very impatient, but uh, most of it was done by Andy. So yeah, Andy Shuffle, that's the guy I was talking about. Uh, of course, you're going to see him a lot here. So go check Andy Shuffle. Remember to use code 254 Millennial to get a discount. And uh, I have a referral link on the description box, so make sure you use that as well. And uh, yeah, did you buy? Again, you've told me most of this stuff is Andy. So did you import? Is there anything you imported? Am I, everything is from Andy Shuffle. No, no, no. I just uh, let him know specs of stuff I want and he usually just sources it. So basically everything is from Andy Shuffle. Okay. Some people do import their stuff. That's why I'm asking this. But uh, yeah, what do you like about this setup? Well, for the amount of money I spent, it's it's it's, it's gone over and above what I expected. So I'm, I'm quite happy with it. Just a few things I'd want to upgrade, like the GPU eventually and the CPU. But other than that, I'm, I'm more than happy than it, with it. All right, all right, all right. Uh, I think we've already answered the next question. You've said you want to change the GPU. But uh, your internet connection, that is something I also was not asking in the previous episode, but it's quite important because most of us play things like Apex, which are online games. But uh, JTL, so why did you choose JTL? Well, I found it, it, it's a bit more stable than Zuku at times. And uh, generally, price point-wise, it's slightly more expensive, but... Uh, You'd rather you'd rather pay, pay a bit more and have a better connection than than cheap and out on Zuku. It's those scenarios where cheap is expensive eventually. So if you cheap out on stuff, of course you're going to end Otomia and uh, Zuku, man. Come on, man. What the fuck are you guys doing with your internet? Like fix your goddamn internet, eh? You know, like what's up? You are the longest. You're the oldest ones here. So I don't get why you guys are like slacking. Nilona, I saw them at our area juicy, but I'm not at a munitem. Tata muweke the shiny new cables. I'm not going to switch to Zuku until, especially for me, I have things like you might have to consider when you get when you're building like when or not building but when you're choosing internet is you know are you a streamer are you like do you stream games do you download a lot of games so zuku has a i don't think zuku has a very good upload that's the problem i have with zuku so but jtl man jtl uh, even though it's expensive pretty pretty cool one and uh yeah so i think um uh if you guys enjoyed uh, this episode you know what to do make sure you like and share these videos with other people man like uh and yeah if you want me to come visit you if you know guys who have setups recommend them to me i'm always on discord on whatsapp that is if you have my number and on instagram so i'm bloody act on instagram i'm bloody act on youtube um i think my discord is already linked everything is probably linked on the link tree so yeah um uh, i don't think i have anything else to say other than i'll see you in the next one